Welcome to Knowledge Powerhouse. In the microservices interview questions, in this section, we are discussing about the basic question, what is a microservice? This is a very common question that can be asked. What is a microservice? And it's a subjective matter. The answer may vary from person to person. But while answering, you have to provide certain important points that can display your knowledge about the microservice. So microservice has these important points. First of all, microservice is a small and autonomous piece of code and it does only one thing and does one thing very well. So it's different from a service. So we can have service that is serving many things, but microservice, we added the word micro prefix. It says that there is a specific thing that is done very well by this service. And it's a, as I said, small piece of code. And it is focused on doing one task, specific task, very well in a big system. Like if you have a big system like Netflix, you have multiple services, you can have hundreds of services, or you can have Amazon, there are like thousands of services. But each service does one specific task and does it very well. And then this is a service that can be deployed, designed, developed independently. It's like an autonomous entity. You can design it. You can again break it down, design it again. You can implement in Java, then you implement in Python, any other like technology you can pick it up, but you keep on having the same interface. So that way, it can be designed, developed, and deployed independently. Then comes that it is a technology agnostic thing. So generally we implement it as a REST service on HTTP protocol, but it's a technology agnostic that it can be Java, Python, Go, any language you can pick it up to implement it. So that way it, it is like a more like a design pattern not a specific uh, thing tied to a technology and because many microservices interact with each other so it is very important to keep it technology agnostic and last but not least ideally it should not share the database with any other service since like it's a microservice if we start sharing the database uh, among multiple microservices then it will defeat the purpose of autonomous code that can be deployed because if you want to add a new column in the table, then you say, oh, my, this version can be deployed only when the version, other version of that service is deployed. So that is the part you don't want to happen. So you want to keep your database within that microservice, whatever is needed, so that you can deploy it independently.